Hey guys, Nick Maxwell here. Uh, once again, I teamed up with Havaco to help out with uh, their latest project. Uh, it's the new Axe 100 SS. Uh, it's the brushless version of the Axe 100. And uh, as you can see, it's green now. Uh, but the other changes that have been made, uh, it's new rotor blades. They're a little bit more stable blades. They're stiffer. Um, it's got a longer tail boom, a more powerful tail rotor motor. Uh, the, it's got some new landing gear that have a little bit better battery holder. Uh, in the previous video, I was talking about the CG is a little bit better if you push the battery back. And so on this model, uh, CG's back further. It's actually a bigger battery as well. It's a 400 milliamp 1S. Uh, it's pretty consistent flight times too from the beginning to the end. Um, just like the other model though, um, it's got real normal servos. Uh, the head is very similar. Uh, the swash plate has been beefed up a little bit, so that's great. So when it crashes, you're not going to be breaking the swash plate as much. Um, the neat thing about this thing is the speed control is actually separate outside of the board, uh, so you can use the motor and speed control for actually other applications as well. Um, the key factor is the new flybarless unit. Uh, there's been a lot of changes made in the, in the um, control loop algorithm, and it works a lot better with the brushless motor, the newer blades. Uh, it's a little bit heavier, but not much, um, but it's the same size as the axe, so uh, it, it's got a lot more power, so it kind of two things kind of counteract and keeps each other out. But uh, overall, it's pretty impressive. It's been a fun helicopter. The tail holds a lot better now, specifically in pirouette stuff. Um, that's the other thing. The fly rail system was changed. One of the key focuses was better pirouetting performance. So anyways, uh, when, you know, when I, just like the other one, oh, it comes with two sets of blades. The, these blades and then uh, these bullet blades. Uh, these are basically the same rotor blade, but they just have three little bullets in there for good for sport flying, high speed flying, outdoor flying, all that kind of stuff. Just like the other model, it's, you can find it to the any link, so you can use an AFG or You can see how much further the battery is. And just like the other one, plug it in and keep it a little still. Okay. One of the key features of the, the brushless one is it actually has a slow start. See just how stable it is. It's actually probably a little bit more stable than the than the old axe. So that is performance is quite a bit better. Just thinking of the high head speed here. This is where the helicopter really excels uh, in big, big open flying. 